Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Colony. Happy Super Bowl Sunday, everybody. I hope you guys are all going to have a great day today. All right. Again, my prediction is I believe the Chiefs are going to win today. I believe Patty Mahomes will be the MVP. But guys, let's get on to this house rules pack and talk about just go go ahead and talk about the coin making method and what you guys should have completed for this Super Bowl promo, okay? So with this house rules pack, I actually got it yesterday on Saturday morning. I did get my, my 25 wins. Um, I'm not going to sit here and lie. It was a little difficult for me because um, I do run a lot of the same plays, but I like to change it up, okay? But guys, here. DeForest Buckner is who we got out of the pack, okay? We got the 96 DeForest Buckner. Now, before I even opened the pack or whatever, I knew I was going to complete the set. Okay, but because I did complete all the six Super Bowl tickets that I needed for the Nat set as well. So I was able, with the house rules pack here, with the, with the uh, DeForest Buckner, I was able to take his card. Okay, I took another card. I'm not sure who it was. I think it was maybe Raheem Mostert. I'm not even sure. But I got the second card that was needed for the San Francisco 49ers Richard Sherman for his set. Okay, so you guys are going to see here, um, I put the Forrest Buckner into the set, I, I go ahead and select the other card that I need for the Richard Sherman set, and I go ahead and put those into uh, the set for the uh, Richard Sherman and the other three cards back as NATs, non-tradable or auctionable. And so what I did was I went ahead, I sold the Richard Sherman for about 470k, alright? Now, would I have liked to keep Richard Sherman? Sure, he's a really good zone defense, uh, really good zone DB. Who, if you play a lot of cloud flats or hard flats, or you want to put him in a curl flat or whatever, he's gonna play those great. He has the height, he has the the press, he has the zone coverage, he has it all, except for speed. Okay, so you don't really want him, you know, sticking with people over the top. Okay, but I decided to go ahead and sell him for the coins. And then I decided to take the NAT cards that I got and quick sell those for training. All right. So I was basically able to make 400 and like 10K coins. And I still have like 17,000 training left over. So I made over 500K in coin value by doing, by completing the set. And I hope everybody was able to do this. You know, maybe you guys haven't completed your uh, house rules yet because I'm not going to say or lie it was a little bit tough for me okay because I I'd like to run a lot of the same plays but what I do with those plays and those formations is I change up the routes so it might be the same formation but I might change up the routes into like four or five different kind of plays all right guys so now that I have all that training from selling those nat players okay I gained about 56k training I mean 50 uh about 52k training all right so instead of doing the 95 uh, past hero I, I did the math and it's a little bit better to do the 96 for 36.7k all right you're spending 10k more in order to make you're spending about 10k more training in, in order to make 100k more in coins all right so to me it just made sense okay I, I bought this, this pack right here. I sold the player for 330k. So now, after selling the Richard Sherman, after selling the Defo this uh, DeForest Buckner right here for 330k, I now made about 410k in coins, and I still have about 17k in training remaining. All right, and I'm not sure if I'm if I'm going to use that for the Team of the Year pack, or if I'm just going to go ahead and hold on to that until next weekend because guys next weekend is series five okay so series five is coming out on friday i think i'm just gonna go ahead and hold my training because i know daniel jones is getting his power up all right and they also came out with a david tyree card he's a limited item today and i just don't feel like buying him for 400 plus k when i can get the 96 power up pass from series five you know they're going to have a 96 power up pass available once you level up. Okay? Plus, I know for sure I'm in, in about seven days, I know for sure I'm going to get another 96 power up pass because of my daily engagement milestones. Okay? 
Now, I was thinking about buying the, the Team of the Year pack, but I decided against it. Okay, so I still have 17K training, and I'm going to wait until next weekend until Daniel Jones comes out. I'll power up David Tyree for the Giants, for my Giants theme team. Okay, and we have Series 5 coming out, so we don't know who the Master is going to be yet. Okay, so a lot of things are going to happen coming Friday. Prices are going to drop. You know, cards that are, are that were limited before are now going to be available in packs. So a lot of crazy stuff is going to happen. All right, so let's move on to the next item. All right, guys, now for the predictor sets. Okay, this is what I put into my sets, guys. Okay, I did the to the coin toss tails and heads. All right, I did the all in bundle for the 49ers and for the Chiefs. Okay, I did both. All right. So if the Chiefs blow out, quote unquote, blow out the 49ers, or vice versa, we will get five Super Bowl fantasy packs. Okay. So I'm hoping somebody gets blown out today. All right. Yes, I want a good game, but I hope somebody gets blown out and these criteria are, are met for either team. Okay. I also did the MVP for Raheem Mostert for the uh, 49ers, and I did MVP Patty Mahomes. I did the first touchdown the field, which is anybody other than the running backs, okay, and the tight ends, okay. So I have both running backs here as well for the first touchdown, and I have the field, okay. I feel very confident in that. And then also I have Patty Mahomes getting 305 plus passing yards, okay. Um, that's pretty much, oh, and of course Chiefs win the game, okay. So that's my base predictions, okay. I used, I have 11 predictions. I used all 15 tokens. Now, the secret that I'm doing, which hopefully you guys took advantage of as well, is I also did probably about half of the solos on my secondary account, okay? So I also got additional bets on my secondary account, which I, on that account, I bet, you know, the, cheat of the uh, 49ers win the game. And I bet the two tight ends one of the two tight ends will get the first touchdown, okay? And I also went ahead and did the bundles a second time on my second account, okay? So I also did the Chiefs bundle and the 49ers bundle on the second account. So if somebody gets blown out today, if somebody gets blown out, let's say the 49ers blow out the Chiefs, okay? They win by 13 plus points, they score 35 plus points, and they hold Patty Mahomes to 305 or less passing yards, I'm going to get not five fantasy packs. I'm going to get ten. Okay? Because I did the extra work. I put the extra work in to do those solos on my secondary account. So I will get double rewards. Okay? So the 49ers blow them out or the Chiefs blow up the 49ers. I'm going to get a lot of fantasy packs. Okay? So hopefully one of those two criteria are met. And we get a lot of packs for you guys. So that you guys can see me open those packs. Okay, so that's it for my predictions. Again, ultimately in real life, you know, and, and not just the game. My prediction is that the Chiefs will win the game. I think it's very possible that the Chiefs will win by two plus scores. Okay, and I, I think it's very possible Mahomes will have 400 plus passing yards. All right, so that's my prediction for today's Super Bowl game. I hope you guys enjoy that game today. All right, guys. So until next time, peace out.